and welcome to Stan Idol episode 2. I am currently in the backyard of my hotel at Washington DC where we will be holding our second round of auditions. Please enjoy this episode and remember to give it a thumbs up. Hi everyone, we're here in Washington DC today and we're here to judge to see who has it and who doesn't. <laughs> Contestant number one, come on out. So what's your name and where are you from? My name is Cole and I am from Missouri. Iconic, okay. I know. Yep, yep. I'm, we stand it, I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so who are some of your biggest musical influences, Cole? I So I grew up in like 70s and 80s music. Okay. So like if you throw at me like some Joni Mitchell or like you get me some ABBA playing, like I am going to be jamming all day long. You get like the Joni Mitchell, you kind of get like a Patsy Cline, like even some like Dolly Parton in there. I really, really love. Love Patsy Cline. Yes, I <laughs> love me some Patsy Cline. I, I grew up in like inspired by her so much. So what are you going to be singing? I'm going to be singing Cherry Wine by Hozier. Or, oh, I, I love that song. Okay. I love it too. Oh my god, I love this song. Will you sing it for me? But I can't sing. Please? Fine. Yay! <laughs> you can start whenever you're ready. Her eyes and words are so I see Oh, but she burns Like rum on fire Hot and fast and angry as she can be I walk my days on a wire It looks ugly, but it's clean Oh mama, don't fuss over me The way she tells me I'm hers and she is mine Open hand or closed fist would be fine. Blood is fair and sweet as cherry wine. Oh, the blood is rare and sweet as cherry wine. Yes, that was so good. <laughs> nice job um i really liked your lower notes the most out of all of it i think that that had the best tone to it and uh -huh. i overall do like the way you sing you kind of are giving a little bit of a cursive vibe whenever you sing but it's not like, i get that so, yeah. yeah but it's not like a bad thing it's not overly like uh -huh. cursive, you know so yeah yeah i get that a lot yeah i just yeah <laughs> um so at first i I wasn't really feeling the performance. Um, it was like kind of like a rocky start because um, I've never heard the song. So I was uh -huh. really relying on you kind of giving me the rhythm and the pacing, um, but it didn't really feel like you had that um, at any point, but you did show a lot of promise in your voice regardless. Like even if I was lost, there were moments where you were like executing runs, um, you're singing in the lower register, um, I mean, you you created your own pacing. Like it was, it was just really enjoyable, um, regardless uh -huh. of those faults that I um, picked up on quickly. So uh, definitely be a yes for me as well. Cool. Yeah, um, I really liked the runs that you did. I also thought you showed like the emotion on your face as well, which is good. Like it looked <laughs> like you were like feeling the song, which is nice to see because last time we didn't really have that. So yeah, the way you like emoted it was good. Yeah. Um, so it's gonna be a yes for me as well. I think that's a yes from Molly, right? Yes, it's a yes. Yes, yes. three yeses, <laughs> woohoo. Okay, so you're gonna go into the breakout room round. Um, Austin will text you about it. It's not gonna be tonight or anything. It'll be another oh, yeah. time, but yeah, we're super excited to see you there. Thank you for auditioning. Thank, Thank you. you. Um, first one. That was a pretty good. This first good note, start. I was like kind of scared. I know. Yeah, that's what I was like started but off. I was like, I I had to, I'm glad that he did well. I had yeah. to bite my cheeks because I was about to laugh when <laughs> he like initially started. I was like, I was about to laugh too, especially because like, Gabe <laughs> tried to stop him. <laughs> <laughs> that's so funny. Contestant number two. Hey. Oh my god. Hey. hey. How are you? Doing great, Hi, how are you? you? Good. So why did you decide to apply for Stan Idol? Um, because I like to sing. I don't really sing like 
um professionally or anything but I, I just I sing in my free time sometimes are there specific artists that you kind of go to um, for singing for singing specifically I tend to just go to artists that use more like um like lyrical type of singing so mm -hmm. I like um like Taylor Swift has good like lyrics per se mm -hmm. um and like Lana Del Rey has good lyrics um and artists like that are you you're gay right are you gay <laughs> because you listen to T Swift and Lana Del Rey. And are you performing one of their songs or someone else? Yeah, I'm actually singing Summertime Sadness by Ooh. Ray. So I'm nervous. That's like that's one of the only that's like honestly the only song I know by her and I absolutely <laughs> yeah. love it. So <laughs> Great. Don't yeah, no, it's one of my favorites by her. It's a classic. <laughs> so Yeah. All right, you can go for it. Kiss me hard before you go Summertime sadness I just wanted you to know That baby you the best I got my red dress on tonight Dancing in the dark in the pale moonlight And on my hair real be beauty queen style High heels off, I'm feeling alive Oh my God, I feel it in the air Telephone wires above us is a log a snare Honey, I'm on fire, I feel it everywhere Nothing scares me anymore Kiss me hard before you go Summertime sadness why are you laughing? I just wanted you to know That baby, you the best I got that summertime, summertime sadness Since the summertime, summertime sadness Got that summertime, summertime sadness Oh, oh, oh I'm feeling electric tonight Cruising down the coast, going about 99 Got my bad baby by my heavenly side Anyone in here? Hello? Where is everybody? Why did everyone leave? I know if I go, I'll die happy tonight Oh my god, I feel it in the air Telephone wires above my season like a snare, honey, I'm on fire I feel it everywhere, nothing scares me anymore Well, yeah, that was it How do you feel? I mean, I feel okay. I, I judge left, so How I was like, oh, sorry, saying, whoops. Me. No, so, man. Uh, <laughs> sorry, my cat it. was coming into the screen, so I had to like- oh, Okay, I thought they were laughing at like my singing. I was like, ah. <laughs> no. Um, I, can, I can start. I definitely think that there's like, there's like, trying to put this in the right words. First of all, I'm gonna say, I, I did enjoy your performance. Um, but there were, there were moments that were rocky and I think it's more because of the style that you sing in, um, that like deep, uh, what was it, rusty, grunty kind of voice um, that you, that you um, sing in. And there are plenty of artists out there that do sing like that. Um, I remember growing up hearing it on like the radio when they would play like pop rock or something or a band. Um, the lead singer usually sings in this style. And so it's, it's definitely um, a way for people to sing. And I think that you have a good hold on that. Um, but yes, I was laughing because there were moments where it did get a little rocky, I will be honest. It was, it was far, far few in between. And so I would definitely say yes for me, just because there was mo more good moments for me than bad moments. <laughs> I agree. I think whenever you went for the higher notes, I honestly preferred it. Like you hit the high notes well. Um, I think that 
there's gonna be singers like you who we put through so like we've had kind of somebody who's sounded similar to you um so i think like the biggest challenge would be like what's gonna set you apart from other people in the competition but yeah i i think that there was obviously some pitchy notes but it's because you were nervous it's not really like a big deal so i think that yeah i would say yes too okay yeah i definitely agree with what aaron was saying about your style of voice um and as well with what gabe was saying about putting you through and maybe singing in a different way or a different song choice that will really accentuate the great parts of your voice and so it'll be a yes from me as well and i think we're all excited to see what you do with the next round mm. Oh my god, I'm shook. I didn't think I was gonna like <laughs> I was so nervous. <laughs> no, that was good. Oh my you gosh. Good, John. Thank oh, yeah. you. <laughs> I hate you bitches. I hate you bitches. I tried so hard not to I was laugh. doing so well. Literally the first half of the performance, I was literally just like <laughs> But then I looked up, I looked up and I saw both of y'all like and I was like, fuck, like, I can't. Hold it. That, okay, that's why I started laughing. It's because I looked at Molly and I noticed that she noticed that I was laughing. Uh, he, didn't, he didn't do terrible. He just was no. nervous, I feel. Yeah. Like, it was like, it, it was, was just the, the circumstances that, like, that made me laugh. Yeah, yeah. it was the notes that were like and, overly cursive. I was like mm -hmm. done. I was crying. That's why, that's why I told him. I was like, there were some moments that made me laugh, but it wasn't often. It was I had to go like, off camera. I got my water. I was like trying to cover my face. Nico, I made it to the next round on Stan Idol. Are you happy about that? You are? Yeah. <laughs> okay, contestant number three, please. Next one. <laughs> oh, not my connection. Hi, I'm JD and I'm from Tampa, Florida. Who would you say are some of your biggest your... musical influences, JD? Isaac Dunbar, um, Evan McIntosh, kids who are like are starting from younger age and are able to like build their own platform. I really like that. And so you like the business yeah. aspect of it too, a little bit, or like the growth aspect. Gotcha, gotcha. So, JD, what yeah. will you be singing for us today? I will be singing "Yellow Lights" by Harry Hudson. Okay, perfect. Take it away. Don't cut the lights, just take it slow. We're moving fast, we've lost control. But I feel safe with you. Love is brave, but I've been scared. I look around, see no one there, and still feel close to you. Cause my life is like a bedroom door. Don't lead me in when you feel low. Cause I might make a move and so what should i do in the darkness of you when you light up my moon from july until june what would i do if there was to tell you would you sing about me like i sing about you because all i see are yellow lights Yellow lights, yellow lights, meet me under yellow lights, yellow lights, yellow lights, we're burning through these yellow lights, yellow lights, yellow lights, when I'm with you. So what should I do in the darkness of you when you light up my room from July until Okay, June? JD, that... I want to start. I want to start. Okay. Personally, I believe you just ate that audition up. I thought that was really, really good. Um, I did not know you could sing. Um, so that was just like, it surprised me. Um, I would say, however, you might want to pick a song with like a, maybe a wider range just a little bit because the notes you hit were good, but it just kind of like stayed here the whole time. So like for the next uh, like performance, if you make it through, I mean, I'm saying yes, but for the next <laughs> performance, maybe pick something that you could just like 
play with a little more with your voice, you know? Mm-hmm. I was a little bit nervous yeah. and then you started and I was pleasantly surprised. I think that it was a really nice performance. I actually really enjoyed it. Um, I would say the same as Gabe, um, maybe a song with a wider range. I think that the only part that was a little bit like shaky was like the June part, but I think overall it was a really nice performance. It'll be a yes for me as well. Yeah, I thought your voice was very pleasant. Um, it was kind of like lullaby-ish. Like I was kind of like getting into this moment. <laughs> and I was like, oh wait, yeah, I'm be like I'm the judge. I'm supposed to be sitting here listening when if I want him to continue. Um, but yeah, I like felt like I was capturing like a little lullaby. And I think it's because like they both said it was like in this like air, like this very specific tone the entire time, um, which can be a good thing. Um, it's up to you ultimately to decide how you want to showcase your voice because um, you will get another chance, obviously, because they both said yes, and I will too. Thank you so guys so much. Thank you, Katie. Thank you. Yep. Thank Bye-bye. you. Um, that was crazy, but uh, I'm glad I made it through. And I can't wait to see what the rest of this competition has in store for me. So wish me luck. Okay. That's pretty good. I thought that was good, but we need to like that's three of like the same kind of singers yeah i was was gonna say that i was literally gonna say that i mean we'll have to pair them up against each other the ones that sing so yeah Yeah. but we just need to have a bunch of this (laughs) i hope we have somebody who like just changes it up hey can you come up with something else can you come up with something else (laughs) (laughs) hi hi how are you hi can you tell us what your name is and where you're from uh yeah my name is brandon i'm from long island new york I am a student. I go to um, Albany College of St. Rose. And yeah, I'm 19. Great. Why'd you decide you wanted to audition? Basically, anything and everything I do revolves around singing. So I figured, why the hell not? <laughs> <laughs> okay. What are, your, what are some of your uh, musical inspirations? Um, I really like uh, Louis Capaldi, uh, John Legend, Adam Levine, like like iconic male uh, singers who have made it. And what are you going to be singing for us? I'm going to be singing All of Me by John Legend. Great. You can start whenever you're ready. (laughs) What would I do without your smart mouth? Drown me in and you kicking me out. You got my head spinning. No kidding, I can't bring you down. What's going on in that beautiful mind? I'm on your magical mystery ride. And I'm so dizzy, don't know what hit me. Well, I'll be all right. My head's underwater, but I'm breathing fine. You're crazy and I'm out of my mind. Cause all of me loves all of you. Love your curves and all your edges. All your perfect imperfections. Give your all to me, I'll give my all to you. You're my end and my beginning, even when I lose, I'm winning. I give you all of me, and you give me all. How many times do I have to tell you? Even when you're crying, you're beautiful too. The world is beating you down. I am around through every move. You're my downfall, you're my muse. My worst distraction, my rhythm and blues. I can't stop singing it, ringing in my head for you. My head's underwater, but I'm breathing fine. You're crazy.
crazy and I'm out of my mind Cause all of me loves all of you Love your curves and all your edges All your perfect imperfections Give your all to me I'll give my all to you you're my end and my beginning Even when I lose, I'm winning Oh, I give you all of me And you give me all of you I give you all Okay, thank you, Brandon. Yay! Yes. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Molly, you want to start? Or I guess Aaron wants to start. We can let Aaron start. Aaron can start. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Your voice is it's great. It's it's amazing. Um I'm speechless if you can't tell. <laughs> um I you you know, so I, for a long time, I actually like avoided that song because I heard it so much um, and I got tired of it. But the way that you sang it, like kind of gave it new life for me. Like you, you definitely changed a lot about the song in terms of how to sing it. Um, but all of it was super enjoyable. It definitely showcased your strengths. It, it's clear that you know um, how to showcase your voice. Um, and it's definitely a voice that's very easy to like just fall in love with it. Yeah, 100% yes for me, for sure. Thank you. Okay, I can go next. Um, I agree with Aaron that I think that you gave a new style, a new spin to a song that was like kind of overplayed on the radio and made you want to avoid it. And so I really did enjoy your performance too. I love the tone of your voice. And I think I actually liked the high notes, like a lot i think that that was like the best part of the performance so it's a yes for me as well thank you yes i agree with my judges i think that um it was probably my favorite performance we've seen thus far um i think that you really like showed that you know who you are as like an artist or like as a singer because like they said it's a song that's like been sung a million times but you change it up to make it your own and I think that's what this competition needs is people who can really just shake things up and make it interesting. So it'll also be a yes for me. So that's three yeses, woohoo. Um, Congratulations. <laughs> congrats. Austin, we'll send you a DM about the next round and yeah, we will see you then. Thank you so much. Um, yeah. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs> um what the fuck that was so good that at was the so beginning good. i was like kind of scared because i thought aaron was about to like laugh and so i was looking at aaron and i was like no i was trying not to laugh <laughs> yeah, I, I mean i you know like it was like me laughing because i was like so like I was just like so nervous. Yeah. I was like, I'm gonna laugh. He's gonna think I think I hate her. <laughs> <laughs> I just hate all the ballads. I wanna see something different. Yeah. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> well. <laughs> a bad bitch has well, entered the building, I see. <laughs> it is true. So let's start off. Does anyone have a problem with me? <laughs> okay, good. Okay, just making sure. Um, okay. All right, so do you want to tell us your name and where you're from? So my name is Imran. I'm from Long Beach, California. I'm 20. <laughs> I'm going to give my age, even though you didn't ask. And um, I know I said on the application I'd be performing a Kate Bush ballad, but um, I changed my mind. Uh, we're doing Catitude by Miley Cyrus. And uh, okay. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> um, yeah, so you, know, you want to just get right into it? I'm, ex I'm just excited to hear you. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Molly Shrews. Girl, you look like you had already done had yours is. 
you better take your country ass indoors and put some damn clothes on because nobody want to be seeing all of that. And how lucky we are today to have the chipmunk with the glasses here today. Hello, Aaron. It's nice to see you from Alvin and the Chipmunks. And also, Gabe, you are just such a shining light of representation for six foot four popsicle stick bottoms. And I'm just so glad that you're here for us today. The library is officially open. This cat is in key. Let me ride that beat. My pussy on fire. Pussy five on fire. This cat is in key. Let me ride that beat. My pussy on fire. Pussy five on fire. Turn up your attitude. See that you got you. I love my pussy. That means I got attitude. You don't feel what I'm saying. I'm fucking you. You don't feel what I'm saying. I'm fucking you. Turn up your attitude. See that you got you. I love my pussy. That means I got attitude. You don't feel what I'm saying. I'm fucking you. You don't feel what I'm saying, I don't fuck with you. Hey, go stupid, go dumb. Come and get it, cause I know you want some. Nashville, can you see where I'm from? Since I was three, I've been digging up in the drum. Rock and pump, pump, rock and pump, pump, pump. Rock and pump, pump, rock and pump, pump, pump. Rock and pump, pump, rock and pump, pump, pump. Rock and pump, pump, rock and pump, pump, pump. Rock and pump, pump, rock and pump, pump, pump. Rock and pump, pump, rock and Rise, shine, talk to pussy time. Let's not pussy up while I'm fingering your butt. Do I suck shit? You ain't seen shit. Throw a scene note while I slide down your throat. Do I have to get my pussy fine? I pop a pussy fine. I don't give a fuck if they call me a slut. What I do with a dick? I let me touch a dick. Put tears in the couch while I'm looking for the dry. Nasty. 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 I keep working from dawn to dusk so I can keep buying cars off Elon Musk. A black black penis, now that's a must. Now I want a full pie, so I ate the crust. On the moon, I'm stars, I'm a Maserati. Love you, Nikki, but I listen to Cardi. Got a new song on the radio, and it goes five, four, three, two, one. Carry on, energy. Carry on, energy. Carry on, energy. Carry on, energy. Carry on, Queen, queen is what you can't call me. Queen, I'ma have you run to a mommy. Queen, I'm the life of the party. Don't worry about me. Go and get yourself a hobby. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> what? Okay. <laughs> I was like, oh my God. That shit took me Caught me off guard. I did not expect it. And that's how you end the performance. And that's how you do it. And that is how you do it. We were asking gentlemen. for something different. <laughs> and different up here. Where did he go? <laughs> Where is he run? Oh my God, I am here. <laughs> okay. Oh, how did I mess up? No, I launched my phone and I muted myself. I don't know what happened. <laughs> wow. Did, did my audio cut out? Like, through? No, 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 that was amazing. No, no. It's like, <laughs> that was amazing. Once you, once you ended your performance, it, yeah, it was done. <laughs> Thank wow. You. Um, I want to start. Well, I want to start. Gabe, you said you wanted something different, and I think yeah. you got it. That's I different. was waiting all day for something different, something mm -hmm. new, like a performance. Even the last time, we didn't really have a performance. And yeah. even though it was a little quirky, I think that. <laughs> That was probably like the most entertaining audition thus far. And I think we need to see more of you and more mm -hmm. of what you have in the future because oh. you really didn't miss a single beat. You oh gave us um, karate too, like karate dancing and rapping yes, singing. Okay. That was amazing. Thank it's you. a yes for me. Uh, now, I, I was a little worried about the reads being a little too hard, but you know what? Uh, oh, <laughs> I, yeah, I love to take risks. No, Actually, they were oh. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> no runs. The beginning with the reads, I was like, this is not America's Got Talent. <laughs> but then you started the performance. I really liked seeing all the water bottles on the desk. I think that, <laughs> that was like a really good detail for me. Oh, uh, thank you. Um, that was the last thing I forgot to clean. It, yeah, <laughs> Please, yes. I, it, I just enjoyed it. It was just something I just really enjoyed. I didn't want it to end. We've cut off the other performances early, but you definitely yeah. ended with a bang um yeah. i do want to do it again so it's a yes from me <laughs> all right 
Yeah, and I mean, straight up, it's definitely a yes for me. I was entertained the entire time. Um, uh, I mean, you gave it all. I mean, yes, it's Stan Idol, um, based off of American Idol, so they focus on singing. But I mean, you just gave too much for us to not say yes, honestly. Like, you know what? I got a boring. lot uh, up my sleeve, but you will see. <laughs> That's three yeses. You're on to the next one. Ah! Oh my God. Am I going to Hollywood? Who's playing You're for the, going room? To Hollywood. Hollywood. the breakout oh room? God. Oh my God. Okay, lay driver. <laughs> Where did it go? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Austin will DM you. Okay. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Thank bye. You. Thank bye. you, bye. judges. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I lost my mind a bit when the camera was when dead. <laughs> when I saw the water balls in the Chick-fil-A, I was like, okay, that's <laughs> Okay, so that's it for DC. We accepted everyone who auditioned. That's Cole, JD, Imran, Brandon, and John. I think that this time had a wider range of performances than last time. And I'm excited to see what they all do for the next round and for the next cities, seeing the other talent. So thank you for watching and have a nice night. Bye.